It's pretty cool. German quad 20 millimeter flak railing with its original trailer. So unfortunately you can't see it deployed, but it is cool. It's almost nicer to have it with the trailer here. It even has wood wood still on it. Uh, wood components. Basically the floorboards underneath the seats which fold away neatly are actually wood. And you can see the magazine racks there with the rubber buffers still in place. The gun shields are folded back. The guns are still on here. One's got the dust cover closed and the other is missing its dust cover. Interesting too, the uh, buffer springs on top. I'm not sure if it's spring in there or if it's just for gas. But anyway, they're, um, they're either aluminum or some kind of galvanized material because they're not rusting. Despite the paint being completely broken off. We got the foot triggers on either side. So I guess, or I see. The loaders sit on these, these things these folded seats. The gunner actually sits here. The gunner has two foot pedals. And I guess that would be right gun, left gun. I'm just guessing. I really don't know that much about these. Actually, a maker mark there. Zavod. Hmm. M3841. That would explain why there's aluminum on it. Early war stuff still had precious metals on it. Technically precious. Precious to the Germans. Really cool. I've never got to see one of these before. Tires are still on it. They're not continental. There's something else. It says Zava on that tire. There's a chance that the tires are Serbian. See what the other tire says. Again, Saba. And both of them happen to be sitting exactly the right way to obscure the maker name.